crafty people, it's Pamela with Gypsy Girl Crafts, and I am here with my winnings from Julie Stein. She had a challenge that she did recently, and it was for um, taking a piece of junk mail and altering it, and um, I, where was it? Oh, here it is. I took a trifold uh, flyer from Joanne Fabric and Craft Store and I did some collage of book pages and then decoupage of napkins on the outside and made it into a little journal and inside I included there were some leftover pieces from the flyer so I made some tags and I just put in some of my avocado dyed paper and some scrapbooking paper and put a couple more tags in the back. So that was my entry into her challenge and you didn't have to send it obviously, just show her what you had done. So that was my entry and I won. Well, she actually ended up giving everyone that participated a prize. So that was really, really sweet of her to do. And she says, congratulations, Pamela. I hope you enjoy my handcrafted items. Thanks again for participating and supporting my channel. Love, Jules. It's just a pretty little piece of scrapbooking paper that's all gold. And I won two things. I'm trying to see this one, I think, was the main prize. And then I got to pick a second prize. Like, hello, it's like Christmas. <laughs> So, isn't this gorgeous? Let's have the pretty gold paper on the outside. It's a beautiful Christmas journal. Isn't that, I think it's a folder, but she just did some collage. And I think this just slides off. It's a folder, I believe, and she's stitched all the way around the edge and I love this because it's cardinals and my mother and father both loved cardinals and they've both since passed so whenever I see cardinals it reminds me of my parents so it's a happy memory so that's awesome that I won this and she has included some envelopes aren't these gorgeous that she's made with cardstock. They're nice and heavy. They're beautiful. They're so festive and just make you think of Christmas and everything. All the warm feelings that you have at Christmas and all the happy memories. Aren't those gorgeous? Thank you. Those are just beautiful. I love those. Let's go inside. I think this is a folder if I remember. Yes, look at this. Look at these papers. Aren't they just gorgeous? I think I'm going to turn the camera so you can see the whole thing as I open it up. Look at these beautiful tags that she's inked around the edge in a red. Those are so pretty. And over here are some little tags in envelopes. Oh, look, some gold trimmings. Oh, those are beautiful. And a little flip. And another little flip. I just love this paper. It's gorgeous. I'll have to ask her what, what the paper line is or if she if it's a digital kit look at that isn't that pretty with the christmas tree and some red deep red trim that's so pretty i love it i love this squirrel so adorable and then you open it this way and look at the pom-pom trim and the lace and a tag that folds out and it's got papers here to write on, like a little notebook, and a pocket here with envelopes. Aren't those pretty? 
And here's another little t flip card. And it just tucks in there. And then the center. Look at these. This is great. These big tags with pom-pom trim. How fun. That is adorable. And a little coin, a coin envelope with another card. Hope I'm, off, I'm not off screen. And another tag. How cute with a little snowflake embellishment. I love the long pom-pom trim on the tags. That is so great, Jules. And then on this side, the same thing. I already did that one, but then it opens up. Two more great big tags. Look at those. Aren't those great? And another little coin envelope with a little tag in it for writing. And another little tag there. And on this side, another coin envelope. So, so adorable. And some cards, like postcard size. So cute. I love it. I just love it. Thank you so much. It's so adorable. And then it just slips back over, and I love the stretchy lace. <laughs> That's great. And then, this is the second prize I got to pick, and I couldn't decide, so I actually put the numbers one through four in a in a bag and drew, So I because I couldn't decide. It was too hard to decide which one I wanted, and I drew this one. I think this one was number four, but she made a bag. It's collaged book, pa book pages on paper, and she just made it into a bag, which I've done this before too, and it is so fun, but I just love how she added the sari silk handles and a nice pocket on the front that she's layered with doily and an image and then a tag. And how cute would that be to give somebody a gift in that? Isn't that sweet? And she's kind of inked it up a little bit. That is adorable. And then this little journal came with it. And it's got paper on the outside to write on. And look at this little fabric address. And a little paper here with Oops, I can glue that back on, but it opens up, I think, so you can write on it. That's so cute. And then a little journal, journaling pages inside. Look at that one, that vellum with the butterflies. It's just fun coffee stained paper and the kindergarten paper that you learn to write on. <laughs> That's so cute. And then a repeat on the other side fabric postcard image and a page and then opens up on this side and there's a pocket with some sweet cards and I love this postage stamp pocket with a another little card and then she's got some velcro pockets at the top of the two that have postcards in them with a stamp and there's one over here oops little tiny paper clip look at how tiny that is a little postcard <laughs> they're so adorable when they're that tiny so that closes back that way and then this one opens up too and it's the same thing. More images and postcards on the little tiny pocket, <laughs> the little tiny paper clip. 
and real stamps. I love using real stamps on my projects too, Jules, so that's really cool. Isn't that great? Just a little pocket journal kind of thing. And it just all folds up and then on the back there's more writing paper. So cute. Such a cute idea. And it all ties up with a little piece of muslin.